what's going on everybody okay so in this video I just wanted to show you a little accessory that I picked up it's a tank bag for the aerial rider it's called Anmelu and I was able to get it off of Amazon once I discovered that aerial rider no longer had their tank bag on sale it was out of stock and I didn't know when it was going to come back in stock it was $29 on there which is a great price for this type of you know, tank bag and so I said well I know a lot of these things are coming stock from China so let me see if I can find something that would match it and so I went on Amazon and I found this bag here it's the exact same bag same size same specifications everything and the same cost $29.95 it was a great price and for this type of bag it's an excellent deal so let me give you some of the specs or let me show you the bag so you can see what's going on so it's pretty spacious inside as you can see I have some water my cell phone a couple of tools I plan on getting some tool bags later but or a tool bag later that I can use to fix the bike for anything that needs to be fixed but for right now this is excellent and also it comes with a waterproof pouch that you can use to cover up the bag in case of rain or inclement weather. Now, let me tell you a couple of cons that you may find uh, with this bag is I'm 6'1", or excuse me, not 6'1", I'm 6 feet tall, 195 pounds. And when I had my smaller tank bag, I could pedal this thing pretty easily. However, what happened when I put this bigger one on here is that my legs bolt out a little bit. So you have to get used to that if you have a smaller tank bag or no bag at all and then let me show you underneath the bike right here on top of the battery there's a button that you push here that shows you how many uh, bars that you have left for or excuse me for your your battery and so that I can no longer see on the bike I have to actually get off in order to see it and that is just a little thing that I have to get used to that's different from what I have done before so other than that it looks good for those that want to add a little motorcycle look to your e-bike this is something that I would suggest that you can do it's uh, cost-effective it looks nice and hey that's about it all right guys thanks for joining me as always don't forget to like and subscribe until next time peace